Hello friends, in this video we will understand the difference between slime layer capsule and glycocalyx. So, this is a bacteria and we know that bacteria have cell wall that is made up of peptidoglycan. So, outside this cell wall another layer is there. And this layer may be gelatinous and loosely attached to cell wall. So, if this layer is gelatinous and loosely attached to cell wall, then it will be called slime layer. It will, it will be made up of polysaccharides and water. But in some bacteria, this outer wall is thick and hard and tightly tightly attached to cell wall and made up of polysaccharides and polypeptides. So, this wall, this thick layer is called capsule. So, this is the difference between slime layer and capsule. If outer covering outside cell wall is loosely attached to cell wall and it is gelatinous in nature made up of polysaccharide and water then it will be called slime layer if it is thick and hard and tightly attached to the cell wall it is tightly attached to the cell wall made up of polysaccharide and polypeptides then it will be called capsule so this is the difference between slime layer and capsule and now the third term is glycocalyx Glycocalyx is a broad term that includes both includes both slime layer and capsule. So, glyco any outer covering any outer covering of bacteria outside cell wall is called glycocalyx. If this outer covering is gelatinous and thin, then it will be called slime layer specifically. And if this outer covering is hard and thick and tightly attached to cell wall, then it will be called capsule. 